Did the president essentially give the green light to Vladimir Putin to take a piece of Ukraine, to take a bite out of Ukraine? I will tell you that part of the, the posture that we have taken is grounded in the respect and the value we place in sovereignty and territorial integrity. Madam and in Vice particular President, in this case, I'm sorry the to sovereignty interrupt. and territorial yeah. integrity of Ukraine. Of course. And so I'm we so are sorry very to interrupt, but it is, had... it is less than clear because 30 minutes after the news conference, the White House press secretary had to actually clarify the president's remarks. Savannah, I'm being clear with you right now. Yes, okay. And, and, and so if you're interested, I'll continue to be clear. Is there any amount of land that Russia could take that the president would allow, turn a blind eye to, not issue those, quote, severe sanctions he's been threatening for that massive full-scale invasion. Was the damage done? You can't unring the bell. Is Vladimir Putin likely to listen to a later statement from the White House press secretary or the words of President Biden? I will repeat myself. And I'm Vice President of the United States, and the President and I work closely together, and I know his position because he has been consistent in that regard. He openly cast doubt on whether the 2022 midterm elections would be legitimate. He said it all depends, um, which is astonishing to hear a president question whether our elections will be legitimate. We've heard it before, but not from this president. Is he really concerned that, that we may not have fair and free elections? States have put in place laws that are purposely making it more difficult for the American people to vote. Laws which will be felt by at least 55 million Americans, regardless of their party affiliation, their race, their gender, or their geographic location. Well, to the point, though, because so those we bills have been were clear, debated. And it's, but it's, yeah, the, the, the bills it's, were debated it's, it's, and they didn't may, pass. If so I may the, finish, the specific, if I, may, if I may course, finish. But the specific question, if you don't mind, does he think, now that these bills haven't been passed, that the 22 midterms won't be legitimate or fair or free. Let's not conflate issues. These initiatives failed because Democrats weren't united, let alone Republicans. Was that an error as you look back on this year? Well, when I look back on this year, I think about things like the bipartisan infrastructure law. Um, administrations, both Democrat and Republican, have tried for years. Well, doesn't that show Republicans do what, were do, willing to help if the, finish, if the initiatives were uh, what, good? But Vice President Kamala we are Harris, doing I am way out of time. Next time, they got to give us an hour so I don't have to interrupt and you can go as long as you want. But we are out of time. I so appreciate the back okay. and forth and Thank you answering you so the questions. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.